Well, welcome back, folks. I think we're going to start on our levels now. Um, there's always a particular rotation with these things, especially in Mega Man. You've got, always got one boss that's weak to another boss, and weak to another boss, and basically they just make a chain. So pick one that you think you can kill with just your X Buster, and you go from there. Uh, I always start with this one. Kind of debating. Yeah. I'm because the first armor upgrade is in this level. Well, not necessarily the first, but the easiest one to get. And it is ridiculously easy to get, so <laughs> we're gonna go for it. Ready! We'll be getting all the armor upgrades. Only because it makes nice look cool. Ignore the fits, folks. It's just me and out of practice. <laughs> and simple as that. Go through a little waterfall and you get your first piece of armor. These boots are awesome, man. Yes, you're right, Dr. Light. This battle should never have happened. I will, Dr. Light. Dr. Light is Mega Man's creator, and actually Mega Man X's creator as well, even though apparently X never met Dr. Light. So he's got a wonder why he was so man to the Not that he's ungrateful. Because now I can do this. And this. Which doesn't come quite in handy. I don't know if I've said it yet or not, folks, but um, this is actually not an easy game to play on the computer. Um, you know, on the regular PlayStation controller, it's very responsive. It did a great job designing that. But uh, my little Logitech kind of PlayStation style gamepad. Well, good. This doesn't quite have the same multi-button touch capabilities. So, it doesn't do quite as well with this game. So this game requires a lot of pressing two or three buttons at the same time. For instance, right now I'm charging my gun. And I need to dash jump, so I have to press circle and X while charging my gun. So basically I'm holding all three of the bottom buttons. Um, it's not, you know, overly difficult, but it's just not as easy as it was on the actual PlayStation. But, you know, I've beaten this game on the emulator probably five or six times, so I can't complain. Yeah, if you ever feel like I can get overwhelmed, just go back a screen. <laughs> it's all good. secret weapon being guarded by this fool, Web Spider, which incidentally, it looks like the uh, Ion Cannon out of Star Wars. <laughs> that wasn't me, mate. That was definitely the humans. And I will not turn back. So while I'm fighting this guy, it's a bit of a uh, reminder as to what's going on so far. 
Sigma has planted the idea in the general of Warper Force's head that the Maverick Hunters are a threat to the Reploids because Reploids occasionally go Maverick. And the Maverick Hunters have to keep killing them. So, Sigma set up a sabotage of Skyline. To, sorry, it's hard to do and talk. <laughs> Set up a sabotage of Sky Lagoon to frame Rebel Force uh, for taking it down. Now that would cause the Maverick Hunters to frame or to uh, label all of Rebel Force as a threat to humankind. So now the Maverick Hunters are in a war with Rebel Force, as well as all the Mavericks. The Rebel Force is too prideful to uh, admit that, or to try and negotiate. <clears throat> so yeah, this is the paradigm of the Mega Man X universe, the whole stealing weapons thing. The shoot a web of electricity, used to attack, wall jump, or double jump. It's actually really cool. You'll see why in a couple of videos, probably. We'll do a save state. <clears throat> and move on to our next level. The Bio Laboratory. Split Mushroom. Good rash. We'll attack whoever visits there. This guy's level is about a million times harder than the actual boss. Not even that terribly difficult. Just annoying to do stuff like that. You never know what those things are gonna do. They're hard to get over. But I don't know, why don't we just teleport into this part to begin with? Or, for that matter, straight from the ball chamber. <laughs> I love the music in these games. A little bit electronic, but <laughs> nice. Ah. I'm good at getting help. Folks, stay on the ladder. Oh, <laughs> that would be new. Mini boss time. Another very simple guy to beat to defeat. As long as you got a quick enough trigger finger. It goes by each of these little square things. So just rest on one of them. Screw it. Blast them. <clears throat> Usually it takes four. Hello, 
bitter. Please, 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 thanks. <laughs> a lot of quick reactions are required here. Good dash skills are necessary. Wow, I'm taking a lot more damage than I thought it was. No worries, folks, as long as I get to the boss, I won't take a single hit from him. And you'll see why. Time to get serious. His voice is so high pitched, it's kind of obnoxious. I want Mega Man to be kind of. Well, Mega. Take it back, his voice is obnoxious. I am. Well, that sucks. Oh, I can take a wild guess. Sick. Okay, folks, easiest fight ever. <laughs> this will continue until he's dead. I may edit it out for crying out loud. Probably not, though. They've been getting his voice. Right, I'm gonna beat him with the X cluster for the rest of this, just to show you what we would actually do. Send out a little cronies. Ow. Ow. Oh, then he splits in two and... Nah, it's not worth it. <laughs> just be glad he's dead. Well, that's two levels down. That was faster than I thought. I may have to do one Here more level this video oh, to make it a full 15 minutes. I really should let y'all read that, but basically it makes a hologram that does damage. There. <laughs> yeah, we'll do one more this level, why not? Ah, now this one... It's a lot of fun as a level, but you have to be quick. So I'll be using safe states. Because you get graded on each little section. And if you get a S rank, then you uh, get a little prize. And those prizes are very important. Now the ability we just got lets us destroy those things rather easily. Save my ammo if I can, but in an emergency I will use it. Alright, that should be good. Rank S. Health, or health level up. Good stuff. This is super important. It's the second one in a row I've got, so that's good. Save. Use the soul body in those. But you only have eight of them for three rural areas in this level. So you gotta be kinda careful. Energy tank. Now those are great. These energy tanks, when you have full health, the uh, health packs that you pick up will get stored in those, and then you can restore your health whenever you need to. Alright, two down. Safe state. This one's a hard one. Oh no! It's okay, you can hit it once or twice, but on that, you're in trouble. Alright. 